Okay, so now we've added your background Divi um, customizations, we're going to just pull them through onto here. So what you need to do is hover over where your dashboard settings is and go to theme customizer. So this will pull up a left sidebar here where we can just alter a few bits. So for example, if you want your logo to be on your heading up here, we can go heading and navigation, header format, and you'll see this is all centered. So we go primary menu bar and where it says hide logo, untick that and it will pull it through here. You can also change your logo size here. So if I make that bigger and I make my menu bigger as well, you'll see my logo gets very big. <laughs> so you can change change that, change your logo size within it. Um, if you want this to change again, we can go back to header format instead of centered, we can have centered in line. We can have default so it shows on the left. It's completely up to you. You can play about with your header settings in there. You can also, sorry, I'm just going to change this back before I get lost and confused. There we go. You can also add your footer um, icons. I'm going to move myself. What we do there is we go to your footer, footer elements and social show social icons. So you can see a faint Facebook's just showing up there. If I go to my bottom bar, my social icon color, I can make that white and I can increase the size of it. There we go. So if you were to add your Twitter and everything, they'd all show up there, but I just added the Facebook for now, so that will link to my Facebook account. Okay, this is also where you can change your text options. So if you go to general settings and typography, then you'll see here, I can click down and I can change my header settings and it changes the font to here. There we go, I can also change my body font and that will change it all there. So we'll scroll down and you can see it's pulled through the new fonts here. And then you just publish that and all your changes have been saved. So I'm going to come out of that for now. And that is how you change your header, your footer and all your fonts.